Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Jody. I actually have been trying to edit a video that I made on my camera and I'm getting so frustrated with it. I'm still back to using my phone so I apologize. I have the Glow Addict box for May. They also have a Mother's Day box which is a separate box. So this is just the regular box. It's $18.99 a month and it just came in a plain white box this month. That's fine with me. Last month they had repackaged and honestly I don't care what the package comes in because I throw it out anyway. I'd rather them spend more money on the contents and then send um, a more plain package. So this is $18.99 a month. It's a monthly subscription. You can do it bi-monthly or pay for three months or a full year or even six months. They also have the eye um, eyes only for $13.99. They have a lower uh, package for $13.99 it's the bag and not the box and then they have a skincare subscription that's a little bit more expensive that I don't do so the only one that I do is the eye eyes only and then the $18.99 so this has four full-sized items in there I think or is it five one two three four four five five I went to their Instagram and got the prices so I'm actually wearing the eyeshadow palette today I just did a really simple look it's Beautiful. It's called uh, Deep Eyes from Ocalon Perfect Stylist Eyes 24 Palette Eyeshadow. And then it looked to me like it's a face palette. So it doesn't have a mirror, which is fine. This is really pretty. Perfect Stylist Eyes. And then this is the palette. Let me remove the clear. I just used some of the brownish and grayish colored eyeshadows today and I did throw this pink in which I think is probably a blush. I'm not sure if this is a highlight, uh, contour, and blush or if you can also use them for eyeshadows but I did use it for a shadow today. These are really pretty. They are not super pigmented so they're buildable. So I, I prefer pigment but I just love these colors. They're beautiful. So I'll get a lot of use out of this palette. And this retails for $32. And on the Glow Addict Instagram page, it says it's eye slash face palette. Next, we got these lashes. And I don't wear lashes. I did try some magnetic lashes. Um, so I will probably pass these on. I have them upside down. These are, let's see, 3D Silk Sativa Lashes. And they retail for $14.99. And... They look really, really long, but they're super cute. Next, we have an eyeliner, a black liquid liner. So I will use this. I'm just not going to open it yet because I have some open right now. So I want to get through those and then use these. I always appreciate getting black and brown eyeliners because I'm pretty basic with my makeup. I know a lot of people have issues with that and would prefer other colors, but I, just, I like the basic. And this is Naked... Nope, sorry. Um... Oakland Cosmetics, so it's the same brand, Oakland Cosmetics, same brand as the eyeshadow palette. Yeah, same brand. Okay, and this retails for $10, and that's about what a black eyeliner costs anyway. Next is Naked Cosmetics uh, Loose Powder Shadows, and this one is in a silvery blue glitter. I don't know how well you can see that. It's very sparkly, and it retails for $14.99. It's a single eye glitter. I've been getting a lot of these lately, and I don't really use the glitter, so I'm going to probably pass this on as well. They are neat to use with a wet brush because you can foil it on there and it has less fallout, and it's a lot more intense that way. And then our last product is a brush. So it took me a while to get into this and the palette, actually. So the palette came in a cardboard box. It's the same, same look as the palette, so I've already put that in the recycle bin. This was hard to get into, so I'm glad I already opened it. This is an eyeshadow brush, and let's see, it's the EO3 brush. It retails for $12, and the brand is $15.20. I think I've gotten some other things from this brand, but this is so cute. Look at that. It's a lot of packaging for one brush, though. So I'm probably just going to throw this in the recycle because I don't know what else to use it for, but it's so cute. And then this is the brush. It's really nice, and it's kind of a shader brush. It's dense but soft. So this is going to be great to pack on some color. It would be good to use with that glitter shadow if you wetted it and packed it on. So again, the value of that was $12. So the total retail value of this box is $83.98. So you can't complain because that's about four times what I paid for it. Anyway, um, I think the eyeshadow palette more than covered the box for me, so I'm very satisfied. Let me know if you get the Glow Addict box and what you like about this and what other subscription boxes you like and what you would recommend for me to try.